The Biden administration is asking Congress to approve a temporary housing program for migrant families that illegally cross the southern border. The administration's ask is part of a $40 billion emergency funding request to Congress. The facilities would allow immigration agencies to more easily keep track of migrants throughout the asylum process, but also could ease the burden on local shelters near the border to house recent arrivals. While ramping up the use of tracking technology and check-ins by phone call as families make their way through the immigration process. And so rather than detain them as illegal aliens to be deported, they want to give them a housing program that basically works as a processing facility where they can be released to the country and where they basically just have the freedom of having entered legally anyways. Uh, the issue you have is, of course, they're ringing the dinner bell. They're saying, hey free medical, free housing. We'll put you up at the, the nicest hotels in New York. We'll put you on luxury cruise lines. We will give you more benefits than American citizens get. If you can get here and get to the border and just enter the country illegally and the Democrats will heftily award you, they will give you everything. <laughs>